welcome back to a, a new video so today's video is all about the uh, ride delight 2024 so we're gonna have a, a bit of a look where it's going to be starting from and the end point with some of the amazing um, scenery and uh, places So after all the uh, disappointment over the uh, the weekend, the uh, the bank holiday weekend, um, with the R and L being cancelled, and uh, part of the um, car show at Stanley Park again being cancelled due to the uh, horrible weather we've been having lately, the ride the lights is on Tuesday, which is the 27th of August, which is uh, literally tomorrow. So uh, on this video, we're going to explore where um, you start from, and uh, a little bit more about ride the lights. Um, so the, the, the Ride the Lights uh, is one of the most magical um, events in Blackpool's calendar um, and it's for one night only and it's just over six miles um, from Stargate to the uh, top of Red Bank Road where it, um, it ends. So yeah, come and join me on this uh, great adventure as we explore some of the uh, amazing things what you'll see on the way. And uh, if you do feel a, a little bit peckish half when you fancy a bit of a pit stop you've also got these uh, great little shops from uh, drink shops to uh, to ice creams little bingo places fish and chips you got all sorts of uh, if you are making a, a bit of a night of it you got plenty of uh, shops um, to stop at so the time of the event actually starts is 7 p.m and it goes on till 10 p.m but I mean, it's entirely up to you what time you want to turn up. It's not sort of set times, but that's the times they've, uh, they've put aside. And uh, it's not a race, it's actually a fun event. So, uh, and it's open to everybody um, uh, who's got a bike. And you can even, you know, grab yourself some chips and just have a walk and just see the illumination switched on and all the uh, probably colorful bikes, which is gonna be uh, riding um, away all the way, uh, like I said, from Stargate all the way to the uh, the top of the uh, of Red Bank Road. And uh, you'll also pass the uh, Odyssey. And that's just located just past the uh, the central pier. So you'll be, uh, look at these, uh, there's another guy probably doing a bit of practicing. So we've seen all sorts of uh, different bikes um, as we've been walking about. But yeah, you'll come past the uh, the Odyssey and uh, the three three lollipops, which uh, which are together. And uh, to be fair, you know, for a bank holiday Monday, after the terrible weather we've had, it's, uh, it's still very, very busy. So we'll just uh, pop onto the, uh, the beach. It's always uh, great to see uh, people enjoying themselves on the beach. And as you uh, continue on your way to the, uh, the resting place, you'll pass all the uh, amazing things. So you've got Madame to Tours, you've got Happy Days, you've got Funland, you've got all sorts of the uh, iconic um, places. Uh, Blackpool is famous for sea life, Coral Island. Um, so you've got all sorts. I mean, if you do fancy a, a bit of a rest, there's plenty of places where you can uh, you can park your bike and chain up. So make sure if you do fancy a bit of a rest and you want to pop in for a spot lunch, right along the promenade, you've got all those uh, silver, like a big silver fence. You can always uh, chain your bike up there. And uh, even if you are unable to ride a bike, um, you can always grab your mobility scooter if that's what you uh, you get about on. Uh, like I said, uh, it's a fun event and there's a uh, something for all so you'll also be passing the uh, rnli lifeboat shop and uh, which is where they uh, launch the lifeboats so you'll be uh, passing that one um, as well so there's no lifeboat training on that day so that's normally a, a wednesday and uh, i'll just swing the camera right round and if you you do fancy a, a bit of a shower you're a bit too hot you want to cool down after the probably in about three and a half miles there's a, there's a shower facility there. And uh, moving on, we've got the uh, Spyglass if you're on a, a swift half. Uh, and you can see they've got the towers getting ever so closer. And uh, just in the distance, the comedy carpet, which you'll uh, be going past. So on a closer look, it looks like it's a, it's a giant ice cream cone. Look at that one. Let's have a, 
whip through the altar fence and uh, it looks like it's a, it's a giant ice cream cone look at that and yeah this is uh, where you'll head the, uh, the comedy carpet um, on your, your halfway point and uh, What's this? It's a, it's a world of a show. It's like there's somebody uh, showing something off. And uh, as you go past Central Pier, the uh, comedy carpet, the North Pier um, awaits you, um, which you can see right in front. And it's probably about one sixth of a mile um, from North to, uh, to Central Pier. But the, uh, the gap between uh, North and South Pier is actually 1.6 miles. So it's a uh, a bit of coverage but yeah so there's a uh, more distance between the uh, central and the, uh, the south pier so if you're still uh, still with me we just made it um just past the uh, north pier um to the uh, metropole hotel which is the only hotel to be built on the uh, promenade and that dates back many of the year um so yeah so what we're gonna do we're gonna cut the video slightly now and uh, head up just past the uh, gin roundabout i want to show you some of the uh great um, new illuminations uh, which you'll be uh, seeing tomorrow so uh, yeah let's uh, let's carry on so this is where you'll be uh, you'll be coming from your stargates will be going all the way along here and uh, you'll also pass the uh, the gin roundabout and you can see the uh, spitfires um, on the on the roundabout so like I said you'll uh, come all the way along here and you'll be on your your final stretch so there is a, a bit of an incline um, as you go towards uh, towards Bisbon and uh, you'll also see the uh, great some of the great hotels the Cliffs Savoy and uh, all sorts up the here and they've also got um, a little nice little waterfall which we're going to have a, a quick look at now. So this is just a, a bit of a shot heading uh, back towards uh, the uh, the Ginn Square and uh, Blackpool Tower. So you'll come all along here and this is where the main illumination start. You can see all the uh, the boards, the sunflower and all sorts. So this is the way you'll, uh, you'll be traveling on the uh, final destination. So we are coming to a, a bit of an end of the video. So what I'm gonna do, uh, I'm gonna put some, uh, some fantastic pictures of uh, the illuminations and uh, what to expect. A bit of a spoiler maybe, but yeah, I thought I'd uh, just bring that. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you do, don't forget, hit the uh, like button, hit the subscribe button, and I'll uh, see you in the next video. And if you do go to the uh, Ride of the Lights, have a good time. Till next time, take care, bye-bye. Fantastic when it's uh, when it's all lit up.